Feast your eyes on some colorful treats at the Lakewood Artist Guild Annual Fall Art Show. More than 130 pieces of art embellish the exhibit. Artists showcase their work in a number of categories. We have a children's category, we have an intermediate and a professional fine oil painting. We have crafts, wood crafts. The art show unites people of all ages, cultures, and skill levels. It provides a venue for that creative uh, spirit to thrive and to grow and to be encouraged. The Lakewood Artist Guild nurtures artists and fosters creative talent. One of those artists is Rita Parenti, who became a member just last spring. Painting was my passion and something I really loved, and it gave me a place to go and meet other people who have the same interests, and that makes me very happy. Children indeed won quite a few prizes in their category. Well, I think it's a great way to, to support our arts community, and uh, the youth program, I'm always amazed to see how the young people, uh, how skilled they are. It's just amazing to see the excitement in their eyes and, and how they really want to do this. It just really helps their um, outlook on life. And then some of them realize they are very good and they go further into art. What's the criteria for an award-winning piece of art? Uh, I look at composition, how the, uh, the artist actually composes the scene. Uh, I also look at how they light the scene or light the, use lighting as part of the composition. I look at, at color, especially how they use color, if they understand how color expresses emotion, expresses a certain feeling. Several art pieces stole the show. Luis Tapia, who studied art in Chile, took his talents to Lakewood. He won the judges award for his Woman 2 drawing. This is a, a shark core, primary shark core and a pen. It was so technically well done. Uh, you know, it had a lot of repetitive patterns that were just beautifully executed. Rich Boyd's painting, Sunrise on the Wind River Ranch, won the Mayor's Award. Horses and Western Heritage themes have become my passion. I grew up in Tucson, Arizona, and horses were a part of my childhood, so I'm kind of getting back to it now that I'm retired. I think it's beautiful, the, the scenery and the mountains behind it. It reminds me of driving through the Midwest. President Mary Crowder won the very prestigious Sylvia Lippi Award for her photograph, McKenna. This is my granddaughter. <laughs> She's always so hauntingly beautiful to me. There's an emotional connection with the subject matter and the way it was lit. It was just beautifully lit and beautifully composed. For Rita, her hard work paid off. Thank you. She won the People's Choice Award. I'm just enjoying myself every minute uh, that I'm involved. I like to see the growth of these artists, you know, and who knows, next year, somebody that uh, won an honorable mention may be best of show. Never know. <laughs> For City TV, I'm Amy Liu.